What is up, people? Welcome to Griever TV. Man, we've had some delays with this match, but it is going live right now. Team Supremacy versus Team World Underground. This is round two of the Our Late Premiership Division with cash money on the line right here, folks. Uh, I've got Bulk and Stye joining me tonight. What up, Bulk? Yo. And how's it going, Stye? I'm good, I'm good. This has been two weeks in the making. It's... <laughs> Yeah, well, you, you are the admin for Division uh, 1 this season, so this I, must I do been not want to talk. Oh, this has been oh. probably my nightmare. Anyway. Cindy getting really good on Cortex on this rollout. Look at this blue soldier. The Ferrisar bomb comes in. He hasn't oh, killed anything no. yet, though. He's still alive, though. Cindy getting taken out there. They are going to clean up Rendo. Oh, and then, oh the medic! Oh, that oh. Surf Havoc is... He got down to 17. He got the health back. He's still alive. Is that scout going to be able to finish him? He does indeed. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love it. That, that wouldn't be classified uh, as a... I, no, no, starting off, that, that's a foul. You know why? He was alive for that long, and he probably did about 200 damage. So <laughs> <a foul>. <laughs> <laughs> he was drinking drink behind them, so drink two, two direct rockets, so that is a drink. Yes, Pryorax and Smithsonian of Team PM, aka Team Mediocrity, playing a drinking game tonight on when Ferrisar, or Ferrilar, as he is known in uh, failed italics, does screw up uh, a bomb tonight. But as we can see, uh, SPR holding quite far back, and uh, there's a good reason for that. That would be Ruix, 100% Uber advantage, and they've got all their players here. Scout already in on this point. It looks like they're going to go oh, for like the Scout Uber. Uber. Oh, they need to get Ooh, some heals on them. Too much damage, though. This is, this is not going to be good. Not going to get anything out of this. They've got the cap, but uh, it's a wasted Uber, I mean, it's, really. It's never a bad exchange, because they are only, you know, SPR has a 40% advantage, and they're probably going to be pretty hesitant to, to try and rush into second with that. Um, looking at it as well, Ruik is, uh, yeah, yeah, no, he's grinding at quite a rapid rate, so, provided they that... Like I, I think Fan wants to go for it, though, if I remember playing with him correctly, he'll, he'll probably chance himself for this, and, uh, we're positioning himself quite well, just kind of holding on the back right of, uh, this point. Havoc's actually taking a bit of damage, he was down to the red, he's up, looks like they're gonna go on the top of the Uber, oh, and... beautiful oh, pipe by Cindy, very nice. Himself. How much damage will Phantom be able to do here? I think he's going to get a good jump off on this combo. Oh, oh the medic, the medic, the medic, the medic. Oh, and Ruik oh, is wow. down. That good is work. a clutch. That are is super clutch. Though? They might lose too many yeah. points. Yeah. Although they have gotten the cap bar. Cortex doing a nice job of sitting on the point there, capping it up. And a very, very aggressive play there by SPR, but it's uh, worked out for them. Yeah, and Fakes had to fall back. Zombies just got some health, and he's forward again. I think SPR is going to get a free mid off this one. Oh no, the medic's right the way back at spawn. Maybe not. Yeah, all the respawn is coming in for Wu right now. Gonna try and get some height in this point possibly to defend it. And of course the Ubers are pretty much exactly even. But of course you do not need Uber to push a point. No, but I, I think uh, with how this map started off, both teams are just gonna wait for the Uber and then we'll see eventually see a push from Wu. In all likelihood. And we'll actually probably see a bomb from Ferrisar, so, uh, gonna be ready for that. Again, Havoc eating some random spam, this time just pipes rolling in, um, and just getting lower than he needs to be, cause... Ooh, <laughs> Solid getting set sky high there. It's only gonna They're take one... They're actually on the left side. Wow. Traded? Oh, no, actually, this is working out for them. Yeah, they've got a couple of key picks there, and they've got Havoc, And they've obviously. got the Medic, so Ferrisar with a successful bomb. Uh, can't, can't do anything for that. Yeah, and look, and the Uber popped, and the scout flank, very nice work. Um, good work by the soldiers, uh, soldier and the demo actually spreading out. Not that it's going to matter, this, this demo is mincemeat. Look, soldier coming out of Z. His life uh, <laughs> probably not going to be long lived. Right, so we've got these two scouts. What are they going to do? Are they going to flank? Oh, Zom taken down. Very nice work by Drakkar there. Yeah, I think uh, Cindy knows he's got to fall back here, and yeah, Cindy and Ruka are just going to fall back into left yard. They've got respawners coming now, so they'll be able to repush in a second. Mm. This is uh, not very one-sided so far anyway, which is good. Drakkar taking a big rocket. He is going to be able to fall, and they're going to push in through left-hand side and garage. Looks like they're actually going to drop out again. Rook getting a little bit stuck there. No one there to punish him for getting uh, caught up. And with a uber advantage on the red side, looks like they're trying to muscle in and take this point. Um, without having to use Uber, I think this is a really good move by them. If they can pull it off... Ferrisar's uh, jumped up top and he's dueling a soldier. Actually, he's not dueling a soldier, the soldier's shooting at the uh, combo. Oh, Cortex with the big pie. <laughs> Sticky there. 
Furisar getting a free kill on the scout upstairs though. And he's gonna Furisar get clever Tommy as well. Surprisingly effective tonight, so uh... Yeah, well that's scout, I mean you get caught in a choke point against a soldier like that and things aren't gonna end well. And they've dropped Phantom. Even though they had Uber, they dropped and, Phantom. Uh, that's not a good start. Oh, that, that, that's technically a failed bomb because he jumped the point and didn't cap it, so that's a drink. <laughs> that's a drink. Oh, that's a drink. <laughs> so that's going to bring a score out to 1-0 in favour of Wu. That's a really good first round by them, um, and that's going to give them a bit of confidence, I would imagine, for the rest of this game. What did you think of the first round, Stone? Oh, I think it's uh, been pretty good for Wu in terms of keeping it pushed. I mean, we did see a little bit of resistance from SPR, but uh, mainly Wu all there. I mean, if, if you look at how most of the fights went there, it was basically decided by the Wu scouts really Definitely. just doing excellent work. And Whoa, up Cindy's on two health. Two health, yeah, absolutely destroyed. Couldn't actually get the health back there, and Magic takes him down with a nice bomb. Yeah. See, that's excellent aggression. You saw that they knew they had that demo advantage. Eyes on Ferris. Yeah, I went there. He's in, he's in! Oh, oh that's a pick! Medic. Ugh. Didn't do it with style though, that's still a drink. So even though they <laughs> got really crushed in that middle, uh, they yeah. managed to salvage this because they've kept their medic alive and uh, it's actually only 3 on 3 at the moment, so they should be able to walk out in the yard soon and then push on to mid. Yeah, they got that Just demo raining down corners. damage, but he is going to have to back back. In fact, I think a scout's in there dueling him right now. Yeah, his zombie's putting pressure on him. Yeah, I, I hope they use this right away. As soon as they have players, go and get aggressive and uh, fuck shit up, for want of a better term. Is anyone looking for the... But no, they've got a scout watching the left side, so... Rena no was able to just wraparound. walk in. Literally walk in before anyone actually put any pressure on him. Yeah, I'm not sure why they actually popped there, because um, I don't really see anyone take any damage. Nope. No. He was a full 300 right up until the time that he rocket jumped, and I mean, that's self damage. I can understand why being a bit nervous about, you know, you really don't want to lose that Uber walking in, but... Same time, they were, they were pretty much in and yeah. safe. And they and need uh, to take this right now. They need to try and take this. Well, they are. They're actually the breaking Uber. left right now. Yeah, this is good. Look at the wraparound. Got a lot of spam there. They're going to get a free soldier. He's way too far forward. That's going to be the end of Phantom. And as oh, the rest of them come forward. The oh! they just completely ignored the left side there. Um, I, I would hazard a guess and say... Oh, yeah, I'd hazard a guess and say that's a drink because uh, job well done. Team down, Magic and Drakkar, the only ones who were left up, being cleaned up by Render and Zombie, and uh, or Zombify, and they're going to jump on the point, and that's going to be 2-0. Wow, we're on fire. Okay, can I point out, this drinking game has evolved from a drinking game to just drink whenever Ferrazar does. <laughs> I, I, I've stayed true to the drinking game. Grievous just wanting to get, uh, get Prorax and just, just wanting to get those other boys drunk. Cindy just, again, yeah. just a little bit slow to mid. Um, he's gonna be alright this time. Still gonna take a fair bit of damage though. Yeah, he's down to uh, 81. Really doing a good job Ooh, they man, knew that bomb was coming though. That soldier is screwed if they can get damage on him. Second soldier jumping in. Actually helped there. Oh, oh wow. Absolutely shut down. That, that was really intense. That was really nice. I, I want to I say that's drink because Ferrazar didn't get the first kill. <laughs> no. Uh, he, he got two kills actually in the end though. Yeah, no, but he didn't get the first kill. No, I'm kidding. I don't think he really jumped though. He just kind of mm. floated around and players just decided to walk into him and he shot yeah. rockets at them. Yeah. I mean, it was all shut down from the start because that soldier jumped in and he got absolutely tuned up. He was able to fall, but you just saw the aggression from World Underground. They knew they had somewhat of an advantage there and they took it, man. They killed those players just, well. Yeah, it was good to see that the team uh, will adjust a little bit there, that noticing that Cindy struggled a little bit on the last minute, so there was a bit of extra uh, uh, scout spam on the demo, and that mm -hmm. kind of helped equalize the health. Indeed it did, just not giving him the, the room to move, although I mean, I suppose you don't want to anyway, but we know the SPR soldiers are going to get really aggressive, so they have to be dealt with. Anyway, looks like going to push out of left, really early Uber, but they've got the advantage, so this is good. Look, they get an early pick on Magic, push on in. They're focusing down the demo right now. He should go down without too much of a fuss. And look at that. Cortex, Phantom, Clever Tommy, Drakkar, and Havoc. That is team down. And we're going to go to halftime with 3 0. Yeah, very close first round, but then it really just uh, turned into a bit of a roll there for uh, Wu. Good work uh, capitalizing on the momentum, I guess, they picked off from that first round. Look at their matching avatars. Ain't that so kawaii? They're so cute. They're, too. they're absolutely disgusting. 
<laughs> it's it's a mean, rainbow of whatever the hell that is. I was going to say, of uh, all the avatars drawn in MS Paint, I'd have to say I am currently, uh, currently has it locked down. They actually drawn it in his paint bulk, or like did someone um, actually yeah, that uh, shit up? Yeah, no, no, Poro actually drew them all. Was it was he bored at work one day or something? Um, no, I think he was just bored at home. Uh, I think he, I think he did one for like uh, Bonimo, and then he was just like, well, I just do one for everyone. Yeah. Oh hell. Right, well we are in half time, people. I can see there's a few new people on the stream. So what is up? Welcome to Griever TV. Uh, sorry, I'm calling us GTV now, aren't I? And uh, we're live with our our late Division uh, One, aka Premiership coverage tonight. Money on the line is Team Supremacy versus Team World Underground. And I don't actually know the stats on these teams so far. Now I think both of them have lost their initial games, haven't they? Because this is round two, I believe. Sty there? Is he gone? Hey, FK. I'm right here. Oh, you are there. You are there. Um, any idea if both of these teams lost their first round? I can't remember who is. Uh, both teams lost their first round. Yes. Uh, Wu got stomped, and I can't remember the score of uh, SPR and Sequential. I think it was no. I can't remember. Mm. Yeah, because this is, uh, as far as I'm aware, this is pretty much the uh, the very middle of Division One currently, possibly the slightly lower end of it. So. I've got to stop calling it Div Division One, don't I? Anyway, we're live with the second half in just a sec. We're gonna reset this config. And I mean, just look at the uh, look at the damage numbers. Like, look at the score. That's that's uh, there's some crazy differences in there. There we go. No one told me I was actually gonna admin, so yeah. It's expected to two admins in the server. Well, three if Cock is still here. Cock is around. Shout out, shout out to Cocker because he's awesome. Yeah, I'm gonna give that shout out to good man, uh, good man Cocker. Oh, okay, so a bit more damage on Cortex this time. He is on 110, but as far as damage Should output goes, blasting across the point, he's doing some really nice damage. Wow, his team's just taking advantage. That's really, really good. Uh, they are getting a bit preoccupied with that scout, but they pretty much turn around and rickroll the rest of them. Only and uh, once again, up. our drink is. Getting a little bit thirsty after that new Verisar being effective. Yeah, yeah. Might have to have an IM game or something to try and uh, get everyone drunk. IM versus Wu. No, because we'll probably just off class and we'll end up raping us. <laughs> no, well, the drinking game wouldn't be failed Verisar bombs, it would be five <laughs> team downs. Actually, no, it'd be uh, the times, uh, the amount of times he gets a video by me. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, that's magic down as they push in. Look at this, just sticky, sticky, sticky. Now he's got the pipes out. They're just slowly but surely removing the SPR players from this picture. And now it is 4-0, the score. Wu is just running away with this bulk. Yeah, it really just... They've just picked up this momentum now and they're just kind of rolling in mid and it's just been a straight roll the last three rounds, pretty much. Uh, yeah. Well, I thought have uh, it getting out. Can, oh, Cortex uh, stuffs up his rollout, so he's not going to be going where he wanted to. Looks like he's going to go left anyway. How many stickies will be waiting for him? All the stickies are waiting for him. He actually did a good job though of uh, managing to move them away and getting them in mid. Yeah. Oh. Here we go, there's a Ferrisart bomb. Oh, and it's effective again. <laughs> Ooh, Cindy. Very close to it. Nah. Ooh. Gets an arrow out of that one too. He's Drekkar. He's looking Dr for someone. Oh, he's, he's, got a, he's got a fair bit of hit. No, he just walks into a rocket, backs away into a sticky. You okay, bro? Anyway, so, um... So, uh, whose POV is he going to be? No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Right, so, yet again, Wu up on this point and in position. 100% Uber Havoc did go down during this rollout as well. And it looks as though they've got a heavy. Ferrisar has gone heavy. Um, it seems he really wants to deprive you all of alcoholic beverages and goodies. And uh, my reliable alt tab uh, tabber has given me uh, upgrade beat woo in round one four four zip five zip and spice boys beat team supremacy four zip on viaduct and four three on blands. Wow, there we go. The five zero to woo. Um, <laughs> comfortable win in the end there. 
indeed. However, the next map is Gravel Pit, and we have seen five zeros followed by two zeros the other way on Gravel Pit, so will be interesting to see how that works out. Honestly, I'd say though, Wu works pretty well together. They look pretty cohesive from where, uh, from where I'm sitting. I, I do like, the one thing I do like about halves, just, just because I can, is uh, I can wait 90 seconds and I can count <laughs> with the with the counter going down. Oh yeah, this is a good point. Mm. No. Right, well we are going to wrap up this VOD right here, because of course it will be going on YouTube in 1080p. If you missed any of this game, hit up uh, Griever TV High on YouTube. Definition. High definition. And uh, 192 AAC uh, audio as well, folks. So yeah, you can hit those VODs up as usual. Takes me forever to encode them, so I sure as fuck hope some of you are enjoying them. And uh, yeah, we'll, we'll get that VOD up, and we're going to head on over to the second map right now, folks. So this is Griever TV. I'm Griever. I've got Big Man Bulk and STI with me tonight. And uh, that could be your new alias, bro. Fat Man Bulk. And um, yeah. Wait, you said Big Man Bulk. <laughs> Big Man Bulk. Big Man Bulk. No, he's, he's a wee slip of a lad. I'm just being a cunt. Right, so we're going to head on over to Gravel Pit now, folks. Uh, if you're on the stream, kick back and we'll be over there soon.